this conference. 呃，欢迎你们到这个说明会。At this moment, exactly at this moment, Pope Francis is about to issue the encyclical letter on the care of the environment, entitled Laudato Si. Praise be to you on care for our common home. 在这个同一时间，教宗方济各在梵蒂冈也要正要宣布他新的通谕。这个通谕是一个有关环保的通谕，标题是“愿你受赞颂”。这是一个祷词的开始。Care for the environment is one of the most urgent social questions of today. It is an argument, an issue which has deep moral and religious roots. 我们这个通译的内容主要内容是有关那个呃环保、保护大自然。保护大自然是今天我们最呃棘手、最迫切一个问题。这个问题也是跟伦理道德有关的。Care for the environment is ultimately a call to respect what God has given us. And to assure that human activity, while transforming the earth, does not destroy the dynamic balance which exists among all living things that depend, in turn, on land, air, and water for their very existence. 保护大自然就是继承天主给我们人的一个礼物，大地是一个礼物，所以我们有这个呃责任去耕耘、去保管这个呃这个大自然，好让大自然不同的生态、植物、动物都能够有它保持它内在的那个生存力以及它们的互动，让这个大自然向善发展。We must be aware. Of God's love and concern for us, and for what God has made. 要做到这一点，我们先要意识到天主对我们的爱，因为这个大自然是送给我们，不是我们自己人做出来的，是我们领受到的。所以先要意识到他对我们的爱，然后从这个爱，我们怎么回应，怎么尽我们的责任去保护这个大自然。This gives us an opportunity to reflect on an integration of faith and life, of belief and action, an attitude which embraces God's love for creation, so, all, all of it, and which we mirror when we dedicate ourselves to the promotion of care for the environment. 当我们提到要保护大自然，从刚刚以上所所讲的简简单的几句话，我们就表示我们要把我们的信仰，天主的信仰，我们相信天主创造了大地，创造了人类，也把大自然送给人类。可是，我们也把我们的生活，我们是怎么在大自然生活的，怎么使用大自然的资源，还有我们的互动都融合在一起。Pope Francis, we have his photograph here. Took the name Francis to honor Saint Francis of Assisi. 教宗他取的名字呃叫方济各。方济各是呃意大利十二世纪一个圣人。Saint Francis lived from the year one one eight one to one two two six. 他是一一八一年出生，一二二六年去世的。As a result of long hours of prayer and contemplation, Saint Francis was deeply aware of the harmonious relationship which exists between all elements of creation, between the human person, animals and plants, and the earth and the sun and the moon. 圣方济他一生都在祈祷中度过，在他的祈祷中，他的默观，他的观察，他深深感觉到天地万物、人类、动物、植物的一个一体性、连贯性以及他们的互动。Most high, all-powerful, good Lord, yours are the praises, the glory, the honor, and all blessing. To you alone, Most High, do they belong. And no man is worthy to mention your name. As you see, the title of the Pope's letter is taken from this prayer. We see the Pope's letter is taken from this prayer. We see the Pope's letter is taken from this prayer. We see the Pope's letter is taken from this prayer. We see the Pope's letter is taken from this prayer. Saint Francis of Assisi offers us an example of genuine and deep respect for the integrity of creation already a thousand years ago. 
在差不多一千年之前，哈，圣方济已经对大自然有深深的尊敬。He helps us to develop a deeper awareness of the harmonious relationship which exists between all elements of creation, plants and animals, natural forces, and even brother sun and sister moon. 他对大自然的尊敬不是只单独这个个体的，而且是在一连串有一个里里里面有一个内在的关系的。In the Pope's letter, Pope Francis is teaching us that each one of us has a part to play in this in this picture in this mosaic. 在呃，传教宗的通谕里面，他教导我们，要我们意识到，在我们整个大自然这个呃创造物里面，每一个人都有一个角色要扮演的。This respect for creation is not only Something unique to Christians. This for the nature of the nature is not just a Christian characteristic. The sacred writings of Judaism, Christianity, and Islam teach that the world is not the product of blind fate or chance. In Islam, in Judaism, and in the Christian faith, there is a common understanding that the nature of the nature is not a coincidental happenstance. The world proceeds from the free will of God. He wanted to make His creatures share in His being, in His intelligence, and in His goodness. 天地万物之所以存在，因为天主要他们存在，所以他们的存在是分享了天主的存在，是在天主的存在内，呃，存在的。Everything has its own nature, its own place. Yet all is interdependent and forms a harmonious whole. 在这个天地万物之中，每一个个体有他自己的存在，可是他们都互相有一个互动，有一个关系的。There is a true solidarity between everything, simply because everything comes from God's hand. 就是因为所有的东西，不同不同等级的存在物、生物、死物、动物都来自天主，所以他们的存在之间都是有一个所谓的精纯团结，是互相有有影响、有帮助的。In contrast to all other created things, the human person is given a responsibility for the rest of creation. 在万物当中，只有人从天主得到了管理大地这个责任以及能力。God entrusted the whole of creation to man and woman. 天主把整个大地的管理责任交托了给人类。Man and woman created in God's image received an order to govern the world with justice. 人人类，男人、女人都是按照天主的肖像被创造的，所以他也领受了管理大地这个任务。Thus, throughout the centuries, men and women have labored to better the circumstances of their lives through a monumental amount of individual and collective effort. 我们可以看到历史告诉我们，从那个以前以前这些呃时代，不同的时代的男女都努力耕耘大地，为使自己有一个好的生活。However, God never gave the human person absolute power over the rest of creation. 可是天主从来没有给人类一个绝对的权柄，是可以滥用大地的。There are limits. Men must not make arbitrary use of the earth, subjecting it without restraint to His will, as though it did not have its own requisites and a prior God-given purpose, which man can indeed develop but must not betray. 男女统统治大地、管理大地的唯一方法是要按照尊重天主创造万物的计划，所以人不能够滥用他的自由去过度的剥削或者破坏大自然。A correct understanding of the environment prevents the utilitarian reduction of nature to a mere object to be manipulated and exploited. 因此，因此对大自然有一个正确的认知是很需要的，这样就避免人类把大自然视为自己的一个东西，一个拥有一个产品去过度的去开发它。Christian culture has always recognized the creatures 
that surround man as also gifts from God. 我们基督信仰告诉我们，在人周周遭的一些存在物、动物、植物，都是陪伴人的陪伴的他们的同同伴。These are the creatures are to be nurtured and safeguarded with a sense of gratitude to the Creator. 因为这些存在物都是来自天主，所以我们人也有责任去照顾它，去保护它。The environment must be seen as God's gift to all people. This nature should be seen as God's gift to all people. And the use we make of the environment entails a shared responsibility for all humanity, especially the poor and future generations. So, when we use the environment, we cannot be selfish. We must think about the future generations. We must think about the future generations. We must think about the future generations. God intended the earth with everything contained in it for the use of all human beings and peoples. Because this earth is not just for one generation, but also for the generations to use it for different generations. Thus, attention must always be paid to the universal destination of the goods of the earth. So, our last thought is to focus on the fact that. 这个大地，它最终目的是为了整个全人类历史存在的。